He said a lot of names. That was why that one was yeah. hard. <laughs> All right. This gentleman is booked on possession of controlled substance. The bond's five thousand, and evading arrest. That bond is fifteen thousand. He'll be represented by Ms. Gavella from the Public Defender's Office this morning. Ms. Gavella, whenever you're ready. Thank you, Judge. Your Honor, um, Mr. Perez indicated that he'd been in El Paso for about two weeks. Otherwise, he's from Chihuahua. He completed the equivalent of middle school in Chihuahua. He has his children. Um, as well as most of his family in Chihuahua, but he does have aunts and uncles here. He'd been working in construction here in El Paso. He has about $120 that he can post toward these bonds, Judge. He is respectfully requesting split bonds or bond reductions, or of course, full PR bonds, whatever relief, if any, the court should find fitting. Thank you, Judge. Thank you, Ms. Carmen. Yes, Your Honor, sorry. My teapot decided to whistle. <laughs> <laughs> um, in this case, this is from July 7th of this year. Officers had an area under surveillance due to um, some burglaries and robberies that were taking place in the area. Um, the vehicle that the defendant was driving was in an alleyway. And when it came out, they began to follow him. He then began changing lanes without signaling and then driving by straddling lanes, making other vehicles have to stop to avoid him. Um, once again, he changed lanes without signaling. At this point, officers attempted to make a traffic stop. The defendant continued to drive um, approximately a mile before coming to a stop. There were eight undocumented immigrants found in the vehicle when he was pulled over. So I don't know if there'll be more charges coming with that one. After he was transported to the jail, um, the officers found a clear plastic baggie in his sock, tested positive for, meth, uh, for cocaine, 0.5 grams. He doesn't have any other criminal history in Texas. He has been arrested in Nebraska. Those charges were dropped, but he was deported. That's showing on his um, rap sheet. Based on nature and circumstances, I believe these bonds are reasonable. Thank you. I'm going to deny any reduction based off of the nature and circumstance of the offense and the future safety of the community. Gracias. Voy a negar cualquier reducción debido a la naturaleza y las circunstancias del delito y a la seguridad futura de la comunidad. Thank you, sir. Good luck. Gracias, señor. Buena suerte.